So I'm working on uh, replacing my surf select module on my 2019 G25. I haven't really seen any walkthrough videos on this, so I figured I'd make a quick one just to uh, help some guys out. Um, so it's a pretty straightforward procedure. As you can see, I've got my both rear hatches open and the main engine hatches open. And I've got the new module here, yeah, which is uh, part number 200169. That's the 3.0 module. Um, and then I've got a screwdriver and a big wrench. So the, the old module lives in the back there. It's a little hard to see. I actually already moved this uh, vent pipe out of the way. Uh, it connects at the back there. Let me get in the back there and then I'll show you kind of where it goes. All right, so now that we're at the back here, you can see that you've got your uh, blower vent pipe that goes up to the uh, vent at the back here. And the module is actually right there. You see it with the orange uh, trim on it. So my blower vent pipe is kind of just, it was zap strapped in place. So I was able to just kind of pull it off real easy. And that'll give you a bit more access to the module. So you can see it's plugged in right there. And then it's got two screws holding it. So you've got nuts on the inside. And then you've got two Phillips screws right there. My uh, table legs in the way here, so I'll get that out of the way. So you've got just the two screws there. So we'll go ahead and take those screws out and uh, pull that old module out. All right, so I removed the two screws and you can see this is the old module here and this just plugged into that harness. So we'll go ahead and unplug it and we'll get the new one in its place. So this is your uh, the 2.0 module. So I've got the new module plugged in there. It plugs in the same way as the old one did. And uh, I've also installed the antenna on it. This one actually, this one comes with the antenna as the, uh, the old one didn't have an antenna. So the only way I can see that uh, it would fit in there is if you have to point the uh, the antenna downwards when you mount it like this or you could actually point it out this way um, whichever you prefer but I think probably down is the way to go so that the uh, the uh, the pipe doesn't get in the way there so I'll go ahead and put the screws back in and uh, show you how it looks after it's mounted all right, so I've got the new module in place. You can see the uh, the antenna's kind of pointing down. Um, I don't really think the antenna orientation matters all that much. So you can uh, tighten up your screws and then reconnect the, uh, the blower pipe back to the vent. And that's it, you're done. Next, you gotta put your boat in the water, fire it up, and um, and connect your watch. All right, so I'm gonna double check and see if it updated in my system here. So we'll go down to our settings and then we'll go system info. And over here you see Surf Select software version is 3.0. So the only thing I notice is I don't know if I need to uh, pair the remote again, but I'll just do it anyway. So I just press the button. Nothing seems to really happen, so. I mean, it's... Oh, actually, it's, it highlights it in the screen there. So I guess it's paired. see it there yeah it tells you so I don't think I had to pair it again but anyway that's fine so the boat's not running right now so I'll fire it up all right 
it's the one to watch. I downloaded the uh, the Surf Select app, so it should be right there. It's in my favorites, so we'll go on it. And the watch is vibrating right now, so I think it, it's trying to connect. So you'll feel it vibrate a couple of times, and then it'll connect. It should connect automatically. Yeah, you see that uh, no connection sign disappeared on the bottom. And now actually I have that little watch symbol on the screen. So I guess the watch is connected. So and I can change, let me go to my surf screen and I'll see if it uh, changes the settings as I go. So NCRS is five right now. Yeah, and you can see it change. Yeah, so it, it works like it should. Hope this helped. If you guys have any questions, let me know.